measuring the frequency of a sound using a cathode ray oscilloscope. If we attach a microphone to a cathode ray oscilloscope and the microphone picks up a pure note, it would give a trace something like this, a sine wave. There are two important dials on the oscilloscope. One is the Y gain, which tells us how many volts of input are needed to rise one square on the vertical axis. In this case, the Y gain is 0.5 volts per centimeter, meaning this trace has a peak voltage of 0.5, 1, 1.5 volts. However, to find the frequency of a sound, we don't need to consider the Y gain further. What is important is the time base. This one is set to 5 milliseconds per centimeter, meaning that the line takes 5 milliseconds to travel 1 centimeter or 1 square. So, for example, with this wave, the time period would be from, for instance, here to here, a distance of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 centimeters. So, the time period is equal to 8 centimeters multiplied by the time base setting of 5 milliseconds per centimeter, giving 40 milliseconds time period. Frequency is given by 1 over time period, which is 1 over 40 milliseconds or 0 0.04 seconds, giving a frequency of this sound of 25 hertz. This is a very low note. Here we have a time base setting of 1 millisecond per centimetre and this wave has a period from, for instance, here to here covering 1, 2, 3, 4 centimetres so the time period for this wave is 4 centimetres multiplied by 1 millisecond per centimetre giving 4 milliseconds. The frequency is 1 over the time period at 250 hertz. Here again a time base of 1 millisecond per centimetre and the period now we could take from here to here which is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12 centimetres giving a period of 12 multiplied by 1 millisecond per centimetre or 12 milliseconds. So the frequency 1 over 0 0.012 seconds 83 hertz. Now the time base is 2 milliseconds per centimetre and the period of 2, 4, 6, 8 centimetres multiplied by 2 milliseconds per centimetre giving a period of 16 milliseconds frequency is 1 over time period 1 over 0 0.016 or 62.5 hertz. A time base of 5 milliseconds per centimetre and a period from here to here 1, 2, 3, 4 centimetres giving a period of 4 centimetres times 5 milliseconds per centimetre or 20 milliseconds frequency is 1 over time period which is 50 hertz. Here the time base is 2 milliseconds per centimetre and the trace 1, 2, 3, 4 centimetres time period so the time period is 4 times 2 milliseconds per centimetre or 8 milliseconds giving a frequency of 1 over 0.008 125 hertz. If there are a large number of waves on the screen it would be more accurate to find the time taken for several waves and then divide by the number of waves. For example we could take the trace from here to here maybe which covers 1 two, three complete waves. Finally, this trace has a time base setting of two milliseconds per centimetre and the time period from here to here is two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve centimetres, giving a time period of twelve centimetres times two milliseconds per centimetre or twenty-four milliseconds. Frequency is one over time period which is 42 hertz.